wait until you see the price of this one. So today we are at RK Motors in Charlotte, North Carolina. The cars here. They are top tier kind of cars. Top tier, like top, top. We have a 1998 Ferrari F355. <laughs> it's one thing about RK Motors is they've got the nicest vehicles you will find here in the Charlotte area. Let's see what Mrs. Carolina Car Dude, see if she can guess the price. How much do you think this Ferrari is? I have no idea how much a Ferrari costs. They're expensive though, right? Like, really and, the, expensive. and this one, yeah, it's like almost- six figures? It's six figures. 140? You're not, you're pretty close, 129. Yeah, that's a beautiful car though. It is a beautiful car. So what did you find over here? I just found this a Bentley. And how much are they asking? $369,900. Oh, wow. We have a 2019 Corvette ZR1. Mrs. Carolina car dude has already peaked the price. It's more than I paid for my first house. It is a beautiful car. We'll look at the exact price here in a second. Look at that price. We have an Acura NSX. We'll take a look at the price here in a second. I know these are super popular. And this one's 1998, and we're looking at a price right under $90,000. So in this building is where they keep all of their classic cars. Can't wait to see the prices on these. So we have a 1961. Corvette has sale pending, so we'll see what the asking price is on this one. And they are asking, or they got somewhere close, $149,900 sale pending. We have a 1959 Chevy Impala. Asking right under one hundred and fifty thousand dollars. See anything that has caught your eye? Yes, I found my 57 Bel Air. It's in like my dream color scheme and all that stuff. The only thing it's missing is like the white wall tires, but it is outrageous. Let's go take a look. We have seen a lot of Bel Airs just because it's one of our favorite. It's Mrs. Carolina Cardew's favorite car. It's, you know, one of our all time favorite cars. This one might be the nicest. It's the prettiest one I've seen. Oh. It's it's sale pending. Look at that. Talk about just a classic, classic car. Let's take a look at the price. Let me take back what I just said. This black Bel Air, 
It's like a piece of art. Absolutely incredible. I'd be afraid to drive this one. And look at the price. So, Miss Carolina Car Dude is a little bit of a hippie. And the hippie in me can't fight the urge when I see these VW vans. You like, love them. Like, you go right to them every time we see one. Oh, you can, like. This one's got a fridge and, like, a little cabinet area. Look at that. That'd be fun to take this to the beach, wouldn't it? Yes, that's what I want to do. Look at it. It comes complete with surfboard. Oh, look at that. And all of this could be yours for right under eighty thousand dollars. We have a 1970 Dodge Challenger. Love the orange. The chrome just pops on this one. And the asking price of right under a hundred and fifty thousand. We have a 67 Chevy Camaro. And we they are asking right under $100,000. We have a 1962 Chevy Nova. It's got kind of a copper paint scheme. I don't think I've ever seen that on a car before. At least a classic car. It's got some modern touches inside. Not sure how pe people will feel about that. And they're asking right under $170,000. We have a 1969 Chevy Camaro pace car tribute. And asking price on this, right under $100,000. So this is a 1970 Pontiac Trans Am. Got a little bit of the screaming chicken right there. A little peek at the hood. The interior is awesome. Love that. And let's sneak a peek at the price. And then they have another little side building where they have some trucks. We have a 1966 Ford Bronco. And let's take a look at the price. This one has got a sale pending. Ford F100, 84,900. Be curious to know what price they actually got. I love the little Ford insignia in the seat. Absolute beautiful truck. And then we have kind of a crimson red one. You are not using the truck bed. That is too nice to use. 
1972 Chevy C10. Of all the trucks in here, I think this would be the one I would want. Let's take a look at the price, some info for all of you, and let's take a look at the motor here. So this is a 1970 Chevelle. This is an incredible Chevelle. Once again, has the modern touches inside and they are asking, you ready? Wait till you see the price on this 65 Chevy Corvette. Man, is that nice. The price is, woo. And here is the price. We have a 1971 Chevelle. So as a lover of Fox Body Mustangs, I am glad to see one in a place like RK Motors. It's an 89 Celine Mustang. Someone has bought it. What a great vehicle. But look at the Fox Body representing a place like RK Motors. When we do these videos, especially when I put out the shorts for these videos, you know, a lot of people are like, there's no way we can get these, we'll get these prices. Well, throughout the building, there's a bunch of either sale pending or sold. So I know a lot of these prices seem like, you know, pretty high, but listen, these cars are selling. We have a Porsche Boxster Spider tell you the more and more we do these videos the more Porsches just keep growing on me and growing up I was never a Porsche fan but as I get older I certainly do appreciate how awesome these cars are a little bit of a glare in that price there you go right under 200,000 So this is super interesting. We have a 2012 Fisker. Do you know anything about the Fisker? Never even heard of it. Never even heard of it, yeah. So the company has gone bankrupt. It's an all electric car. And what I think is kind of interesting being here, it is, let me get, get the glare there. You can see the price right under 38,000. It is the cheapest one we have seen in the building here. You have all these classic muscle cars, just beautiful cars, combustion engines, and then you have an electric car that is the cheapest of all these vehicles. We have a Pontiac Trans Am. Glad to see this here. My daughter's super excited about that. And the asking price for the 91, Pontiac Trans Am is right under $34,000. So we are in the heart of NASCAR country. We have a Jeff Gordon race car. It's 
So if you didn't hear me, we have a Jeff Corden race car. It is for sale. Now, let me, let's ask Miss Carolina Car Dude what she thinks. How much do you think the Jeff Corden race car is? Oh, the foggiest idea how much they charge. I would have guessed. I would have guessed like high, like six figures. Yeah, I would have said two. Yeah. I would have said like two or three hundred thousand. I would have at least gone like one eighty. Let's take a look. Okay. So this Jeff Gordon race car could be yours for under seventy four thousand dollars. So if you have made it to this point in the video, thank you. First, yes, thank you very much. Apologize for the noise. RK Motors is right on the interstate, but uh, this place is awesome. It has the best cars. Like they're now they're charging for the best, but it they are so so pretty. You will not find a better selection of cars on consignment than at RK Motors in Charlotte, North Carolina. And one of my favorite things is how they have them like separated. So they have like the modern, the classics, and then the trucks, which I think if you know what you're looking for, it just makes it going in a lot easier. And it's free. Yes. So if you have kids or you're, so, you're just a car lover yourself, bring them here, come check them out. You will have a great time. Yep, All right, bye. Bye.